is Sister Lakey with news and announcements for St. John and Maxville, Kansas, on Cable Channel 3, and also at sandylandcenter.org, our website. <coughs> Today is Wednesday, the 29th of April. The temperature at no time in the square is 69 and we're going to have a sunny day today, and the high will be 72. Uh, Thursday will be similar, it'll have a sunny day, and the high will be 77. <clears throat> and the temperatures keep going up for the rest of the week, pretty much. Friday, partly cloudy, 78 the high temperature, and there's just this little 20% chance of rain. Then on the weekend, Saturday and Sunday, both partly cloudy, 83 the high for Saturday, and then a very large 87 for Sunday. <clears throat> so it looks like spring may be here for a while. And then we get our big chance for rain on Monday. The forecast is for rain, the high temperature 79, with an 80% chance of rain. <clears throat> and here we are at the end of the month. There's not a lot of news and events that are happening because they haven't told us about next month yet for all the events they have. And we have no birthdays today. And the uh, most important event that will probably happen for the city of St. John is the book sale at the library. And so uh, Thursday, April 30th, uh, they have the preview sale. Admission is a dollar. If you're a member of Friends of the Library, it's free and you get first choice at the books for sale. Then on Friday, uh, everyone uh, can come and uh, the there's no admission for that, and it's from 8 o'clock to 5, I'm sorry, it's 3 to 6 on, uh, on Thursday, so 3 in the afternoon to 6, then on Friday, 8 in the morning to 5 in the afternoon. And that is the main sale where everybody comes and there's no uh, admission or anything like that. And they hope that most of the things are gone. But uh, just so that they don't have to throw away good books on a Saturday from 9 in the morning until 12 at noon time, they're having a bag sale. So you can get a whole bag of books and that will help if you have any doubt, well then you want to take that book and, uh, and buy it and put it in the bag for the sale. And that will prevent having to throw away really good books and other things that they have on sale. So the library, coming up. Then I have only the uh, menus of the senior fellowship meals <coughs> to go. And here we are. Uh, the Sunflower Finnish Senior uh, Fellowship Meal is... Uh, quinch, whatever that is, quiche, I, it looks spelled wrong. Anyway, so they're having that, and then, then on Thursday they're having uh, tuna patties with uh, seasoned rice, and we don't have the schedule for next month yet. And here in uh, Maxville at the VIP Center, they're having chef salad today, and uh, tomorrow uh, they have a choice, salmon patty or beef fingers and cream peas. And those are all of the, uh, all of the menus. <clears throat> so, we hope you'll stay tuned for a short message about God's story. And the program is almost finished. Uh, and you could uh, stay tuned uh, Monday night to see the main lecture for God's story after the news, and, uh, and it is on the internet as well if you go to sandylandcenter.org. 
And that's all I have for you right now. The word of the day is, <clears throat> never go out to meet trouble. If you just hang back and don't do anything quickly, somebody else will go out and meet the trouble before you do. This is Jim Wakey, hoping you have a really great Wednesday. This is your story. This is your story. This is your story. This is my story. This is my story. This is my story. But most of all, this is the greatest story ever told. This is God's story. This is God's story. This is God's story. I know you're going to enjoy the incredible journey you're about to embark on. The story is brimming over with tales of mystery, intrigue, adventure, of love, heartbreak, and triumph, of power, of struggle, and finally, of redemption. But remember, the Bible is not a hundred ancient, unrelated paintings, but a mural all knitted together to tell the story of God's great love for us and the extent to which He will go to get us back. I know you're really going to enjoy and appreciate this wonderful experience as you fully explore how we all fit into the greatest story ever told, God's story. This is God's story. This is God's story. This is God's story. I'm Ray Davidson, pastor of First Southern Baptist Church here in St. John on the corner of Second and Exchange. We would like to invite you to come and join with us as we look at God's story, the story of God's interaction with man. We'll begin on September the 7th at 9.30 a.m. With, with a worship service followed by at 10.30 with Sunday school. This is a study for everyone in the family. All of the children, young people, adults will be studying the same lesson so that we can talk about it at home as we go through the week. We invite you again to come and join us on this 31-week study of God's story and man's story.